Hi friends, my name is Jessica Sharon. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to talk about the nearest hundreds. We last time talked about the nearest tens. The definition of rounded off. The rounded off value of a number is the approximated value and not the actual value. Now I am going to talk about rounding off by the nearest hundreds. Like last time when we did the nearest tens, we checked the ones place but the same only we have to check in the tens place. But however we have to not check the ones place, we have to check the tens place however and put zero there in the ones place. If the tens place is 0 till 4 we have to put 0 in the ones place and the tens place keeping the other digit same and if the numbers are in the tens place numbers are 5 up to 9 we have to put 0 in the ones and tens place and add 1 to the hundreds place keeping the other digit same just a second, I will show you some examples for all of them. Now I will show you some examples. First example is 610. 610. We have to round off to the nearest hundreds. We have to put, however, we have to not check the ones place and put zero. Now we have to check the tens place. If the tens place is 0 up to 4, we have to put we have to put 0 and put the other number same. So now I'll put 0 in here and keep the other number same. So the answer is 600. Now the next one is Now this is 750 Now 5 up to 9 I will tell this first Now we have to not check at the ones place Like I said we have to put however 0 and 0 here but check it 5 and up to 9 we have to put 0 and add 1 to the hundreds place so it is 8 now I am going to show you some examples for thousands in round, rounding off by the nearest hundreds as I said we are going to do thousand numbers with the nearest hundreds. Now we have to put zero. Whatever number it is. Any number in the ones place we have to put zero. And, and the next number we have to check it. Zero up to four. We have to put zero and keep the other number same. So I put it zero in the tens place and I kept the other number same so my answer is 1500 my next is 2897 we have whatever number it is 1 do any number we have to put 0 and we have to check the tens place the tens place is 9. 5 up to 9, we have to add 1 to the hundreds place, keeping the other digit same. So, now I will put 0 over here and add 1 to this one and keep the other number same. So, my result is 2900. So, friends, I hope you understood this. Now, can we do the match the following? I will explain on the full way we do. As I said, 
can we do that match the following of the nearest hundreds? This is the tenth ones place. Whatever the ones place is, never mind it. Put zero. And we have to check the tens place. This is nine. Five until nine. We have to put zero and add one to the hundreds place. So I put zero in this both and add one to the the hundreds place. So this is two goes to two hundred, and this is one thousand seven hundred eighty six. We have to not mind the ones place. I told now I am not tell that we have to never mind this ones place. We have to mind the tens place. The tens place is eight five up to nine. We have to put zero in the ones place, in the tens place, and add one to the hundreds place. Now the number same. So zero, zero, and I add one to the hundreds place. So this is eight. One z eight zero zero. One eight zero zero. So then it goes to one thousand eight hundred. Now this is. Nine hundred twenty-one. This is the ones place. Never mind it. We have to mind the tens place. The tens place is two, and from zero up to four, we have to put zero and keep the other number same. So it is nine hundred. This is nine zero zero. So we get the answer nine hundred. We use rounding off by the nearest hundreds to count students in school, count people in crowds, count patients in the hospital, etc. I hope you understand my topic. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye bye.